right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a closer look at these speaking cases. I tend to bring these back every now, every so often when there's a new drop for phones. But today we're gonna be specifically looking for the new S24 Ultra. I have it here in the natural gray and that like new titanium. And I have the S24 Plus. We're gonna be taking a closer look at the new speaking cases. These are the new hybrid ones. This is actually the one tap metal ring case for the s24 ultra and we have the s24 plus ultra hybrid regular and i will be starting with the s24 ultra i think this is the main kind of like appeal main video so here is a quick look before we get into the case so here's the s24 ultra we're taking a quick look at this color it's really really nice i think it's it's one of the better looking ones in my opinion i've been using this phone for the last few week for the last few days that's actually been like two days or so and i've been really really using it like in and out i i think it's a really good phone it's amazing, has fantastic performance, has some really good features, and the AI is actually really, really nice. Just saved my life so many times. I've been able to find so many things online just by that quick search. But let's get into the case without any further ado. Put this to the side here. So we're looking at the new regular hybrid cases. I really like the speaking cases, especially for like Samsung's because they do look really nice and really clean. So here we go. I've never actually had a one tap ring case for a Samsung before. This is the case, classic, classic Spigen packaging. There we go. That looks really nice, it's super clean. That's the thing about these cases, I, I just really like how they're simple, they're clean, they protect your phone. And with phones like this, like the S24 Ultra, the S24 Plus, we're getting nicer and nicer finishes and nicer and nicer colors overall. So I just think it would be a shame for you to just get a case that's super bulky so here we go let's just peel off these stickers from the back let's peel this off real quick there we go let's also peel this one out there we go take a quick look at this new one tap metal ring looks nice it's super clean i feel like the overall build is really similar to how they used to make their cases although it has some slight changes that i can notice so I noticed that first things first, like the branding is a little bit more visible now on this one. The overall one tap metal ring, it's obviously different than MagSafe on Apple devices. So that's something that if you guys weren't aware of, then you'll know now. But another thing I've noticed is that the overall outline shell is a little thicker, I guess, than before. And then if you look at here at the, on the corners, there's the air cushion technology. It feels like it's now built on the inside of the case. So it doesn't, you'll see it here, but it's like inside of the case and not on the outside. I feel like older speaking cases have had this air cushion technology, but really like a small bump on the outside. So hopefully I would have been able to show you guys that on camera, but hopefully you'll be able to kind of see it from this video. It is a natural lighting as well. So this is probably the best you'll get. Let's get this S24 Ultra inside of the case and let's see what this looks like. There we go. So that's one thing that I really like about speaking cases that when you put the case on the phone, it just snaps on and then it's secure. It stays in there. Oh, that is clean. That is nice. I'm typically not a fan of cases that have like the smart ring or like this, this kind of device or in general, I'm not usually a fan of that, but I got to say for this one, it looks really clean. It's nice. The camera layout and everything is super clean. There you go. The buttons are also really, what's nice about speaking cases that the buttons are super clicky. I'm just gonna put that closer to the mic so you guys can kind of hear it. So hopefully you guys would have been able to hear that properly. But yeah, the overall speaking case, super clean, minimal design. I'm also gonna show you guys the bottom here so you do have the cutout for the USB-C and for the new S Pen. Here you go, so if you ever wanna use the S Pen. I found myself using the S Pen relatively often with this S24 Ultra, especially in situations where I was just like editing photos. So like in gallery, when I go in gallery and I'll pick like a random picture and I just wanna edit the photo, I have been doing that. So that's been something that's been very convenient. But I'll just put that back inside here for the purpose of this. So I'll give you guys one last look at this right here. So I'm gonna put that to the side now and we're gonna get into the S24 Plus, which I actually have to admit, this is probably my favorite Android smartphone at the moment on the market. I just think it's amazing. It's one of the better ones in my opinion. It's it's so nice. The design, this new refresh to the overall S20 lineup is really, really nice. I gotta say, I really like the S23 Plus last year when I reviewed it, but this one is just a little bit better than that one. So obviously it's gonna replace it in terms of my preference. And if we take a quick look to compare it, for example, like this to the iPhone 15 Plus, this definitely takes it. It's by far better in my personal opinion. But that being said, here we go. We got a regular hybrid case for the S24 Plus. Let's just unbox this really quickly. There you go, guys. So I feel like for these ones, 
we're looking at kind of like the same build overall so this one also has 90 percent recycled paper so see these ones they're built the same i'm starting to see a bit of more of consistency in spigen's build when it comes to these cases let me put this phone to the side and put the box to the side as well so we're going to be getting into this unboxing just taking this out right here there we go this is the simple clear case now last year for the s23 plus i actually reviewed a, a similar case but it had a kickstand so like a metal kickstand this one's regular it's not it doesn't have that kickstand i kind of just wanted to have like a clean overall finish for the s24 plus just want to have like a you know just like a simple nice kind of like white clear on clear kind of feel and kind of look to it so that's what i'm going for here i'm gonna here we go, putting in the S24 Plus into this vegan case. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. I, I could literally, this right here would be my daily build, like my everyday build. I would literally rock this S24 Plus with this vegan case on a day-to-day -day basis. This would be like my go-to. I actually would rock this. This is really nice. It's super clean. I love this new design. It's so minimal. It's, you know, it's not, it's not, it's not even heavy at all. Now, one thing I'm going to point out real quick, I've noticed in terms of the design, that's obviously going to be different due to the shapes of the phones being different. So this one doesn't have like those edges. It kind of does, but only at the top and at the bottom. So you'll see there's a nice thicker line here and a thicker line at the top. So that allows the phone to stay steady on a flat surface. But on this one, it's going to be your classic design from speaking. So it's going to be the little corners and the air cushion as well. So this time around, if you take a quick second at, to look at the air cushion, it is also now built inside. The design is slightly different. Same type of buttons, USB-C cutout. And there you go. That's what it looks like. It's super clean. I really like it. I, I, just, I think I'm never going to get over speaking cases and how minimalist and simple and just overall clean they are. And they really protect your phone and they don't yellow fast. Like it takes months and months before these start to yellow, if anything. So let me know what you guys think of these new speaking cases. Do you like them? Are you going to be picking them up? If you guys were ever interested in picking these up, I'll leave some links in the description down below for you guys to make your job to make your life a lot easier but yeah let me know what you think about the cases i think they're really nice do you prefer the simpler ones so just like a regular design or do you prefer the one that has a bit of a design like the MagSafe for a bit more functionality i think in terms of design this one's my favorite it looks better it looks nicer but this is definitely something that i would see myself working on a day-to-day -day basis with that being said as always if you've enjoyed the video make sure you give the video a like subscribe and as always I wish you the best of luck in everything you do, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Deuces.